welcome to church, family. Anybody else excited to be here? All right, I am. Will you guys stand? We'll uh, we'll begin. We'll begin worship.
else excited that Marshall's back on the drums? <laughs> hey -oh. Anybody else excited that Emily's up here with us? Yes. We're gonna lose we're gonna lose her for a little bit, so we're excited to have a have a team back. So will you guys pray with me and we'll just continue. Dear Jesus, we love you so much. We're grateful for this opportunity to worship you. Uh, we just pray that you go before this service. Lord, I pray that you go before Pastor Marshall and uh, just help, help him just to be hidden behind your cross and just have him speak your words. Lord, we love you. We're so grateful just to be in the house of God. In your precious and holy name, amen.
And you guys may be seated. I'm coming. <laughs> what an improvement from last week. Amen. Glory to God. Uh, soon I'm going to lay down this old crutch here too. And I'm going to be dancing up here a little bit. I tell you, when you lose something and you get it back, how thankful you are for what you have. And if I lost my voice and I got it back, I'll tell you, I'll be shouting unto the Lord. Oh, I wish I had the voice of some of y'all. I would be singing night and day. But from my heart, I do make a joyful noise. For he is worthy of our praise. Amen? He really is. I, I just love that psalm when David said, Oh, I rejoice when they said, let us go to the house of the Lord. Thanks for being here. It's a privilege to be a part of this worship service with you. Uh, our ushers are prepared to come forward. As they're coming, let me just give you a couple of quick announcements this morning. This coming weekend is a scrapbook event here at the church, and our teenagers are going to be a benefit of that uh, that, that, that scrapbooking sale. So uh, we need teens Friday at 3.30 on to sort of set up and get the vendors ready. And also on Saturday during the day, we'll need some helpers as well around. And so uh, parents with teens, I'll be reaching out to you. Let me know kind of your schedule of your teenager and how much they can help and be a part of that. And that money will be earned, will go into their personal teen accounts for future events and outings. Also on the, on the uh, 15th, that's uh, next Monday, I believe it is. Uh, women's Bible study starts up, and Heather Sweeten, who does a tremendous job of uh, the women's Bible study, will be walking through some of the women of the Bible. And so you want to be a part of that great study. They meet here at the church at 7 p.m. Also, February the 10th is Victoria's Secret uh, Breakfast at 9.30, February the 10th. And on the 24th, a brand new event added to our church calendar. It will be our trivia night. Trivia night. So if you love trivia, if you've got some friends that do, if you want to be part of a team, uh, we'll pair you up. It's going to be a good time of just fellowship and getting together and uh, learning some of those facts. Many of us, like me, I've been told all, by, my, by my wife again and again, I've got a lot of useless knowledge, she calls it so graciously. Uh, Rich, you know what I'm talking about, right? Uh, and uh, I say, hey, useless, come trivia night, you're going to want me on your team. I can, I can use that. So anyway, more information will be coming uh, for that as well. hope you had a great new year. And we're back at it, and the church here is wrapping up here in a couple months, and so you'll be seeing some information and announcements of uh, future plans for our church. So let's pray together as we uh, give the Lord his tithes and offerings today. Heavenly Father, God, we are just so humbled and thankful to be in this place today. Lord, we could have been anywhere. In fact, you could have chosen not to wake us up, but you did. We've got one more chance and opportunity on this earth with the breath that we have left in our lungs and heart, uh, blood left in our hearts, God, we just want to give everything of who we are back to you this morning and just worship you in this place. Wow, to think the God of all creation is here this morning in the presence of the sweet Holy Spirit. So God, we want what you want this morning. And we give you permission to sift through us, Lord. Let those things bubble to the top that are displeasing to you. Let us do some business, Father. I pray that your word, which is a two-edged sword, would do some spiritual surgery on us this morning. We just want to be more and more like Jesus. Father, encourage those hearts who have come this morning who need encouragement. Bring some good news for somebody who is in darkness. God, would you let somebody know that you are real and that you love them, that you have a plan for each person in this place. And we'll be sure to give you thanks, for you are worthy. In Jesus' name I pray, everyone said, amen. amen. God bless you as you give.
stand as we continue to worship. Beautiful. 
Good singing, guys.
Psalm 34, verses 1 through 8. I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continually be in my mouth. My soul shall make its boast in the Lord. The humble shall hear of it and be glad. O oh, magnify the Lord with me, and let us exalt his name together. I sought the Lord, and he heard me and delivered me from all my fears. They looked to him and were radiant, and their faces were not ashamed. This poor man cried out, and the Lord heard him and saved him out of all his troubles. The angel of the Lord encamps all around those who fear him and delivers them. Oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is the man who trusts in him. I love you, Lord. Oh, your mercy never fails me. Oh, my days I've been held.
that chorus one more time? I'm just not ready to preach yet. It's too good. God bless you.